Did the ribbon unexpectedly disappear on you? Or maybe you just see the tabs. Would you rather the tabs and commands always be visible? Let's look at your display options for the ribbon. Welcome to this tutorial. Let's start by looking at the three options you have to display the ribbon. In the upper right corner of your screen, you will see the Ribbon Display Options icon. Click on that icon and there are three options on how to display the ribbon. Auto Hide Ribbon, Show Tabs, Show Tabs and Commands. It all comes down to personal preference and how you want your display to look. If you want more workspace for your document, you might want to auto hide ribbon. To actually display the tabs and commands, you simply move your mouse to the top of your document and click once. Once you start working in your document again, then it will auto hide. Or perhaps you want to see the tabs only. Then you can show tabs. You will only see the tabs across the top and once you click on a tab you will see the commands. Once you click back in your document to continue working then it collapses again to only the tabs. If you want both the tabs and commands to always display then you want to show tabs and commands. Then it will always stay at the top. You can also collapse or minimize the ribbon with the collapse the ribbon icon. And that's this little arrow right here. If I click on that, then it will collapse the ribbon. When I click on a tab, it will show the commands from the ribbon. And if I once again want to show tabs and commands, I can click on the pin it icon to pin the ribbon back in place. The keyboard shortcut to minimize the ribbon is Control F1. If you're on a laptop, remember you may have to use your function key. What this does is it toggles it on and off. Control F1, I only see the tabs. Control F1 again, and it brings back my commands. You can also double click on any of the tabs. And again, I'm toggling on and off. I can turn off the commands by double clicking on a tab or I can bring them back by double clicking. I used Word to demonstrate the ribbon display options, but it is the same for Excel and PowerPoint. So now, if suddenly all commands disappeared or you want to purposefully make them disappear, you now know what to do. Thank you for watching. I create these videos because I believe we never stop learning. And if you like this video, please subscribe. And I think you might like this video. And I'll see you in that one.